And, and this is what makes Billy Edwards special, right here. And you take us through that almost game tying drive down uh, here over your left shoulder. Yep, yeah, we uh we got the ball back. Uh, we ran the ball first play, you know, defense defense was sitting in too high shell, Twan made a good cut, um, offensive line blocked well, got the drive rolling, and then I think it was two, three plays later, found uh, Leon on a you know a little corner out there in the front pile and he made a heck of a catch and then going for two. Uh, you know, we had a play called Coach Gaddis, head coach of the red team, called a timeout, we'll have to talk. He, he may have known what we were running, but called a timeout, so we went with a different call and I just got flushed and you know, my brother and the coaches on the staff, you know, two point play. I was just trying to give someone a chance, so I think, you know, if I, if I got my feet underneath me, I could have hit it on Eli Mason, you know, right in the chest, and we would be having a different conversation right now, but it was just good, you know. I think the thing that I took away the most from this spring game was the, the end-of-game situations I was able to put in, the two-minute drives, the critical downs, you know, not taking a sack in, in field goal range and things like that. So that was just, you know, that was a good drive, a, a good experience for me to learn from. With finer four gates, You've heard the phrase, we make your company work. What that means to us is that we take care of every ticket, every call, all the time. Try Viner 4 Gates, or making your company work is our primary mission. You kind of touched on it, you know, just new personnel, new coaches, obviously, and things like that. Where do you feel like maybe the offense took the, the biggest stride this spring? I, I don't think I could pinpoint it on one thing. I think, right, you can, you can sit there and say the tight end room's gotten a lot better. I think the quarterback room competitions, you know, from top to bottom is getting better. Offensive line's producing well. You know, like I said earlier when I was talking to someone, Coach Gaddis came in here and, and he's given his flavor of things, and, and that's taking more shots, more pushing the ball downfield, but also he likes to run the ball. You know, he's, he says he's an offensive line guy at heart, and, and you know, what he, what he was able to do at previous schools, he wants to be able to run the ball and run the ball with, with, with poise and power and, and establish that up front. So I think top to bottom on the offensive side of the ball, we've, we've seen, you know, major strides and major improvements that, you know, when we come in fall camp, we can, we've already gone through those hiccups of learning the offense and, and we can kind of get, get the ball rolling when we get back. Have you and you got anything you kind of taken away from the younger quarterbacks and just kind of come and bring them along as well? Yeah, no, I, I, when I see those guys, like I think of myself this time last year uh, in my spring game, in my spring, and that was when I made the biggest jump for myself. Um, and, you know, we're always talking ball top to bottom, like we're always yeah, talking things out, seeing... See them, you know, if one of us see things differently, just trying to learn and grow. And I think that's that's the good thing when you're when you're in a room like that and, and all these rooms are there's internal competition and we're we're trying to make each other better and push each other.